Welcome back everyone to the channel. Uh, today we are talking about Shades of John Deere Green. So I thought I'd take an opportunity here. Um, again, sometimes this question comes up on like the message boards and things like that. It's talking about what shade of John Deere green is technically correct for, you know, the tractors. Um, so when you go to a John Deere dealer, it, if you were to buy John Deere paint, uh, there is the classic green, uh, which is meant to be for the classic tractors. And I'll talk more specifically about where that applies, supposedly. Uh, the ag turf is for the later generation. And then just for comparison, I got the Rust-Oleum JDD Green just because I know a lot of people use that. For simplicity, I just have spray cans here. Um, of course, it should be about the same as if you were using a can of it and using a spray gun or something like that. But this video is just to provide perspective. Um, obviously, the shades may look a little different on your TV screen, phone screen, things like that. So if you ever want to stir the pot uh, with either friends or relatives or something like that, you know, when you're sitting around the holidays and, and things, you can ask the question, when did John Deere stop using the classic green paint? Well, you, you can even ask the question, what is the John Deere classic green paint? So the classic green color, from my research, wasn't actually introduced and distinguished uh, to the ag turf and green till um, quite a few years ago, but the John Deere Classic is supposedly, according to John Deere, used up to 1989. So that would have been all of your tractors, you know, your two cylinders, new generation, Gen 2, all that up until the 55 series tractor. So, you know, like your uh, 42, 55, 44, 55, that, or things like that. Um, where that really gets people heated and debating as they claim, oh, my tractor's all original and there's no way it's this green of a paint. Um, it's more like the ag turf and green and so on. I, I don't know. I, again, that, that's not really my place. I'm just telling you what John Deere says. Before 1989 is technically, according to John Deere, John Deere Classic Green. Now, Richard Hain, uh, one of the authors and publishers of the Green Magazine, did note, and, and this completely makes sense, I mean, do you really expect, you know, a shade of green to be consistent from the 1920s all the way up through 1989? No, there's probably going to be changes in the, the paints and things like that. You can see the classic green is... Um, a little bit darker of a green and it's I would say more of a a, a grass or, or forest green uh, looking at the ag turf it has a, a little bit lighter of a color to it and then um, on the camera it doesn't seem like you can see much different between the ag turf and green and the rustoleum the rustoleum looks to me like it has a little bit more of a blue hint to it uh, than the ag turf and green so the ag turf can be a little bit brighter of a green. Um, so I, I would say, certainly looking at this, the Rustoleum John Deere green is certainly closer to the ag turf uh, green. So where hopefully I'm not stirring the pot with all of this is you all paint the color that you want to paint. I'm just here trying to provide perspective on what the different colors look like in relation to each other. Um, so, I don't know. I it, if if you paint one or the other, you, you may not like. If you put ag turf and green on a two cylinder tractor, lots of people do it. Um, I'm not sure that you'd really notice it. Maybe, um, you know. But of course, when you put them side by side like this, you'll notice it. I have heard the John Deere green uh, tends to fade uh, pretty quickly, or at least the John Deere paints unless you put on a, uh, a clear coat or something like that. But yeah, so that that's up to you. I guess also here I didn't talk about it is buff primer yellow. 
So if you are ever removing paint from your tractor, uh, John Deere, their buff primer, sanding primer, um, it is yellow. So when you're removing paint from your tractor, know your tractor was not industrial. That is the primer that was used on the tractor. And I've also heard it's not really a great uh, sanding primer. It's better to use uh, another brand or something. But again, that's everyone's choice and and what you want to use. Uh, so like on my B, that is what I did though. I, I had buff primer yellow and I used classic green. There you have it. Uh, let me know what you think. Um, let me know what you guys have used on your tractors. Uh, if you guys have any other questions or uh, you want to show me what projects you guys are working on, painting or even anything else, you can email me at danielfarmchannel at gmail.com. I'm interested to see what all everyone is working on and uh, hopefully have some more videos coming soon. I'll try and get those uh, John Deere hydraulic cylinders back together and uh, see what other kind of projects we can get into. So have a good day.